Hello everybody, welcome back to the potting shed. Um, Easter Sunday, beautiful spring morning and my sweet peas that I sowed on the 7th of January are starting to get a little bit big for their pots. So all I'm going to do is repot them um, and here's how we're going to do it. So I've selected some pots, 5 litre pots and uh, I've mixed a, a general purpose compost with a little bit of feed. Uh, just to give them that boost. The roots are starting to show at the bottom of the sweet pea pots and that's a good indicator that they need to be transplanted. So if you look at the plants they're quite healthy and they've got a good uh, root ball on the bottom as you can see that they tend to curl around at the very base and uh, the other parts of the compost can crumble away but don't worry about that we're going to put them into larger pots and I'm going to put four into I think it's a four or five litre pot uh, I'm going to put four in uh, and just spread them out and they should have a lot more room to grow. Dead easy to get out of the pots, just give them a bit of a squeeze, twist them round and out they come. Space them out equally and top up with your general purpose compost with a little bit of extra feed added just to give them that boost. And the reason we're growing Fragrantissima is, as it says in the name, really really sweet smelling flowers and they can be cut and put in a vase on your dining room table or in the bathroom anywhere in the house really where you'd like fresh flowers and a lovely scent and fragrantissima are the best sweet peas for that uh, i've got some budlia sticks i trimmed the budlia back not long ago and right i haven't got any bamboo canes so i'm using budlia i've cut it to about a foot foot and a half long and I'm going to use those as the supports. I'm putting three or four in, using an elastic band that I've recycled from when I bought my vegetables the other day because I bought some broccoli, and sometimes they have elastic bands around the bottom. So reuse, recycle. Uh, so I've made a little teepee, and our sweet peas are going to climb up. Now, they look a bit limp in the pot there, so what I'm going to do next is get a bit of string and just wrap it around the base to hold those seedlings up until the tendril which are the climbing part of the plant can grip onto either the string or the budlier sticks that i've put in and this little teepee will support them because we're still getting some quite breezy days in april march april so um this added support will keep them secure until the plants can secure themselves and that's what we're after so a little bit of string it's not plastic string, it's, it's the dupe type stuff that dissolves over time, so I'm trying to avoid using plastic if I can. And uh, yeah, these little sweet peas are quite happy in their pot. There you go, loads of room. The string will support them till the tendrils grip hold. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye!